Welcome to Toddler Tales. As you know, I'm Miss Kristen, and I'm so excited that you are here today. And now that we're all here, let's get started with our claps. We clap and sing hello, we clap and sing hello. With all our friends at story time, we clap and sing hello. Now let's wave. We wave and sing hello, we wave and sing hello. With all our friends at story time, we wave and sing hello. And now, that's right, we're gonna stomp those feet. Here we go. We stomp and sing hello, we stomp and sing hello. With all our friends at story time, we stomp and sing hello. Now that's a great way to get things going. And we're gonna start um, by first talking about the word hooray. Hooray means you're so excited and so happy. Well, I wanna tell you that I feel so excited and so happy and I'm gonna shout out hooray. So right now, we're gonna learn the sign for hooray. So you're just gonna take your two hands and put them up by your face and then you're just gonna shake them kind of like this back and forth. You wanna do that at least twice. So we'll go, hooray! So hooray, it's time for Toddler Tales. All right, let's practice one more time. Hooray! Very good. And we're gonna use our hands for this next song, so let's get them ready. We're gonna stick them out like this. Open them wide. So, open, shut them, open, shut them. Give a little clap, clap, clap. Open, shut them, open, shut them. Put them in your lap, lap, lap. Creep them, crawl them, creep them, crawl them. Right up to your chin, chin, chin. Open wide your little mouth, but do not let them in. Open. Open, shut them, open, shut them. Give a little clap, clap, clap. Open, shut them, open, shut them. Put them in your lap, lap, lap. Walk them, walk them, walk them, walk them. Right down to your toes, toes, toes. Lift them, lift them right up to the sky and touch them to your nose. Now we're gonna shake them, shake them, shake them, shake them, shake them just like this, this, this. Roll them, roll them, roll them, roll them. Blow a little kiss, mwah. Nicely done. Now our next song is going to be Tiny Tim. So we're gonna learn our sign for turtle. So you're gonna make a fist. Remember you pop up your thumb like this. You're gonna take your other hand, kind of bend it like this. You're gonna place it on top of your thumb. And it looks like a turtle poking its head out of its shell. So here we go. I have a little turtle. I named him Tiny Tim. I put him in the bathtub to see if he could swim. He drank up all the water. <laughs> he ate up all the soap. <laughs> and now he's home, sick in bed with bubbles in his throat. Bubbles, 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 pop. Bubbles, 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 pop. All right, and now it is time to get ready for our book. Hooray! So let's get our hands ready. My two little hands go clap, clap, clap. My two little feet go tap, tap, tap. My two little hands go thump, thump, thump. My two little feet go jump, jump, jump. My little body turns around and around, then sits quietly on the ground. Our book today is Hooray for Hat. And this book 
was written by Brian One. Now, if you remember, you know the sign for hooray. Do you think you could do that right now? All right, I'm gonna use just one hand since my other hand's holding the book. But here we go, hooray! Well, we're going to see hooray for today a lot in our book. And every time we see this phrase, you're going to make the sign for hooray and shout hooray for today. Do you think you can do that? Awesome. Oops. I'm wide awake and ready to play, said Al. This will be a good, good day. Hmm, what do you notice? about this picture. That's right, the moon is in the sky. So is it daytime? No, it's actually nighttime. But we know that owls are nocturnal. That means that they sleep during the day and are awake at night. So little owl just woke up and it's nighttime. She packed her toys and set off to find her friends. Look, she packed her wagon. She looks like she's ready for a party. Al knocked on Elephant's door. Okay, you ready? Get ready. Hooray for today! I have my hat. Would you like to play? So there's little Al. What do you think Elephant's gonna say? Let's see. But Elephant did not want to play. Not now. I'm sleepy. So Al tucked Elephant back in and whispered, maybe another day. Good night, Elephant. Oh, she's a really good friend. Uh-oh. Then Al found Zebra. Ready? Hooray for today. I have my trumpet. Would you like to play? Look, Zebra's even got her blanket. Do you think Zebra's gonna play? Let's see. But Zebra did not want to play. Not now. I'm sleepy. So Al tooted a lullaby and whispered, maybe another day. Sleep tight, Zebra. Then Al found Turtle. Hooray for today! I have balloons. Would you like to play? I have a feeling that Turtle isn't gonna wanna play. What do you think? But Turtle did not want to play. Not now, I'm sleepy. So Al Rock Turtle to sleep and whispered, maybe another day. Sweet dreams, turtle. Look at how Al rocked turtle to sleep, using her balloons, very clever. Oh. Who did Al find now? That's right, Al found giraffe. Hooray for today. I have some books. Would you like to play? But Giraffe did not want to play. Not now, I'm sleepy. So Al read Giraffe a story and whispered, maybe another day. Nighty night, Giraffe. 
When Al found lion, she couldn't hoot a single word before lion growled, not now, I'm sleepy. So Al whispered, maybe another day. Rest well, lion, and tiptoed away. Owl shouted into the night. And what do owls say? That's right, who, who. So she goes, who, who, hooray for today. Can anyone come out to play? Let's see, let's see if anyone shows up to play with owl. Doesn't look like it, huh? Today is a bad, bad day, Al said. Nobody wants to play. What do you notice? The sun is coming up. Nighttime is almost over. So Al slowly walked home. Do you notice anything behind the tree? Al's friends were waiting. Good morning, Al, they all shouted. Would you like to play? Al yawned. Not now, I'm sleepy. But after my nap. And one last time, we're gonna make the sign for hooray, but we're gonna say hooray, let's play. All right, get ready. Hooray, let's play. And that is the end of our book. Okay, so up here on our flannel board, we have some yummy cake. You know what I like to say? Hooray for cake. Don't you love cake? Me too. Now, in one of our cakes up here, Little Snake is hiding. Do you think you can help me find Little Snake? Okay, but before we start, let's see how many cakes we have. There's one, two, three, four, five. We have five cakes. And they're all different colors, aren't they? Let's go over what color each cake is. This cake is yellow. And this one in the middle, pink. This one is purple. Up here, blue and orange. Very good. So where do you think Little Snake is hiding? Under the orange cake? Okay, let's start with orange. Little snake, little snake, are you in the orange cake? Let's see. Oh, no, it is a stinky shoe. P.U. All right, let's see how many cakes we have left. We have one, two, three, four, four cakes. Now, where do you think little snake is? You wanna try yellow? Sounds good to me. Little snake, little snake, are you in the yellow cake? Let's see, is little snake hiding here? <gasps> no, what is that? That's a cow, very good. What do cows say? Moo. All right, now let's see how many cakes we have left. We have one, two, Three, three cakes. So where do you think Little Snake is hiding? You want to try purple? Okay, let's give purple a try. Little Snake, Little Snake, are you in the purple cake? Let's see? Oh, no, what is that? Oops. What is that? It's a pig. And what do pigs say? Oink, oink. Very good. I had to use tape to get that cake to stay up. We have one, 
two, two cakes left. We have our blue cake and our pink cake. You wanna go with blue? Okay. Little snake, little snake, are you in the blue cake? Let's see. <gasps> no, we found a duck. And ducks go quack, quack. All right, well, we only have one cake left and that's our pink cake. Let's say our rhyme. Little snake, little snake, are you in the pink cake? Let's see. There's little snake, we found her. And what do snakes say? Yes. That was fun. All right, boys and girls, it's speaker time. Hooray for shakers. All right, our first song with our shakers was we're gonna move them up. Are you ready? Here we go. Egg shakers up and egg shakers down. Egg shakers dancing all around the town. Shake them on your shoulders, shake them on your head. Shake them on your knee and put them straight to bed. Very good. Now we're gonna do one of my absolute favorite songs. It's new, we've never done it before, and it's called The Elevator Song. And we'll start off pretty slow, since it is a new song. Let's go riding on an elevator, elevator, elevator. Let's go riding on an elevator. First floor, second floor, third floor, fourth floor, fifth floor, and down, 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 down. Very good. So let's try that faster. Are you ready? Let's go riding on an elevator, elevator, elevator. Let's go riding on an elevator. First floor, second floor, third floor, Fourth floor, fifth floor, come along with me and down, 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 down. I think we can go faster yet. Here we go. Let's go riding on an elevator, elevator, elevator. Let's go riding on an elevator. First floor, second floor, third floor, fourth floor, fifth floor, and down, 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 down. Wow. You guys did that really fast. Let's slow things down a bit and we're going to just shake our shakers. Here we go. Can you shake along with me, along with me, along with me? Can you shake along with me? Put your shaker on your knee. Very good. Let's try another body part this time. Can you shake along with me, along with me, along with me? Can you shake along with me? Put your shaker on your shoulder. All right. Hmm. I have to think of a good one. Can you shake along with me, along with me, along with me? Can you shake along with me? Put your shaker on your head. All right, hmm. That's a great one. All right, we're gonna try putting our shakers on our tummies. Here we go. Can you shake along with me, along with me, along with me? Can you shake along with me? Put your shakers on your tummy. Excellent. All right, boys and girls, we're out of time today, but we're going to use our shakers to do our goodbye chant. And we have done this before, but we've not used our shakers. So here we go. We're just gonna go like this. Bread and butter, marmalade and jam. Let's say goodbye as loud as we can. Goodbye. Excellent. So we did that really loud 
What's the opposite of loud? That's right, quiet. Shh. Bread and butter, marmalade and jam. Let's say goodbye as quiet as you can. All right, let's see if we can think up some more opposites. How about we start with fast? All right, bread and butter, marmalade and jam. Let's say goodbye as fast as we can. Goodbye. <laughs> All right, what's the opposite of fast? Slow. Bread and butter, marmalade and jam. Let's Say goodbye as slow as we can. Goodbye. Very good. I know another set of opposites. Let's say hi. Okay. Bread and butter, marmalade and jam. Let's say goodbye as high as we can. Goodbye. What's the opposite of hi? No. Good. Bread and butter, marmalade and jam. Let's say goodbye as low as we can. Goodbye. Now, one last time. Let's say goodbye as nice as we can. Bread and butter, marmalade and jam. Let's say goodbye as nice as we can. Goodbye. Oh, boys and girls, that was a great toddler tales. Thank you for joining me today.